Welcome to Gamer Use Tips and Tricks for part two of the new world recently released for Plants vs. Zombies 2, The Lost City. This video is about the returning limited edition plant, the Dandelion, which was first only available on Easter earlier this year, but is now available again for purchase during the Lost City Part 2 update, along with three other limited edition plants. If you already have the Ghost Pepper and want to get a second limited edition plant you missed, this will probably be the one. The Dandelion throws bombs into the lanes nearest to it. They will float over to an enemy and detonate for some decent splash damage. They also have a great plant food attack in where they will launch a hail of seeds into the sky that will rain back down onto the zombies for major splash damage everywhere. That's not their biggest appeal though, the real benefit to these things is combining them with air blowing plants like Blover and Hurricane. When you use these plants they will cause the dandelion seeds to get blown off its head like a real life dandelion, burying the zombies in a deadly swarm of seeds. Dandelions that get their seeds blown off will become momentarily powerless and cannot attack but will eventually regenerate and grow their seeds back, allowing you to either let them attack again or repeat the process with another blover. With a blover you can just drop one anywhere over and over to flood the lawn with dandelion seeds all over the place wrecking havoc on the zombies. Since blovers are already extremely useful in Lost City, using the dandelion here probably is a good idea, but note that only a couple of dandelions will fire off all their seeds at a time when you use blovers, never all of them at once. That's all for now, stay tuned to Game Ryu for more info on Plants vs Zombies 2 Lost City Part 2.